Hi, I welcome you all in this new video and this new video is about very important function of Excel in which you will learn how to create data which is required for you to give demo for various kind of statistical operations. Most of the cases we need some data and what we do normally we type data in manual way. For example, this way, or you can take these values or some values and we we'll just drag it down and this is giving some different numbers. So it creates, it takes a lot of time. So how to avoid this all cumbersome methods? The best thing is to that use Excel function. And the very important Excel function is, that is, is equal to and in just typing rant, you have seen there are two different options are coming. It also giving here, what does it mean? It returns a random number greater than zero or equal to zero and less than one. Okay. So if we use rant function and here write zero and just give space without giving space, close and just hit enter. So this is giving a number which is in between zero to one and you can drag it down. And so this is giving a random number, but important for you, if you will write something in any other column, you will do any other operations. So this number will keep on changing. So best method is to avoid this problem is select the numbers. Right click, copy them, and again go here, click here, it's special, and it's special go for value. Now these numbers are freezed. If you do any other operations, now these numbers are not changing. So this is one important function where you want to have your number from zero and to one. But if you want to have number more than this, then what to do? Let's move on to another sheet. Now let's move on to second function. Second function is rank between. And this function is very, very important. For example, if I want to generate number of 50 students who has scored marks between 40 to 100, and I need not to type manually, just use this command by using rank between is equal to comma 40 and 100. Just Let's close the parenthesis and hit enter. Now see, if you drag down it up to 50 numbers. So here the number series is generated. Right? We need not to get into typing manually. But what I advise you, it's better to select the entire data, just copy it and the important thing that you need to do, you have to go to the first cell and paste as a value. Now, there will be no change in the operations of these numbers. So this is very important. For example, we want to use another example. I want to have salaries of the people, salary between 10,000 to 50,000. So what I need to do, simply hit equal, go for rank between, yes, you are right. Then we will take parenthesis. I want salary between 10,000 to 40,000. By hitting enter, here we have to take 10,000. And this has given us the salary range, which is ranging between. 10,000 to 5,000. So this is this creates a random series where you can use this data for your research purpose of I hope you have liked this video and you have understood how to use random number series in Excel. Thank you.